uh, the 2009 uh, Doha WTA uh, championship. It is, I mean, I, I watched it for the first time the other day. It's incredible video. Yeah, uh, Actually, um, obviously was not a fun time for you then. Um, no. But what do you recall from that? I still look back and I'm thinking, how did I, how did I win that match? You know, I was up, I think, 6-love, 5-1, and I had match points. And then all of a sudden, Serena Reva starts to play incredible, and we got into this third set, and I get full, I had body cramps. I already had leg cramps from the second set on. Uh, I had an injury going and it was uh -huh. really hot and it kind of started cramping and then I started my other leg and then at five, four and a third, um, I just went, I hit the shot into the net and I kind of get disappointed. I put my body backwards and I just start cramping first in one leg, then the other, then, you know, calves, then stomach, back, everything just start cramping. I fall down on the ground and I'm just told, we can't help you up. I'm like, I can't stand up. And they're like, we can't help and you. And they can't help you because you they already got help. a treatment no, during that match just, for cramping? Nobody's cramp allowed to help you on your legs. So okay. you just have to make your own way up. And then you cannot get cram you cannot get treatment for cramps. Because uh, it's not considered like an injury? It's not considered an injury. So, you know, it's so I was kind of like, OK, you know, I'm out on my own here. Uh, and somehow I managed to finish that match. I was in I had some uh, fluids, uh, some uh, I had to be into an IV after the match and was lying there for like two hours cooling down. It was crazy. And to clarify here, I mean, literally, you're like standing up after, you know, you hit the ball and it is it's as it's if your legs body. just get, like give out completely and you. Yeah, hit, hit I mean, my hamstring, my, you know, my thighs, everything just started cramping up. And every time I try to stretch one leg, you know, I cramp in the other and then I'm trying to stretch that and my back cramps and then I'm trying to do right. that and my stomach cramps and I, then I just fall down on the floor. I look like I'm getting shot or something. You, I mean, you did. I did, yeah. Yeah, obviously, you know, like you're on the ground, you managed to get up, tears, yeah. uh, understandably, you know, coming, coming down. How many other girls do you think would have toughed it out? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think a lot. I don't know how I managed to do it. I mean, I was in so much pain and yeah, I was exhausted as well. And as I said, I looked like I'd been sh shot. So when I look back, I'm like, you know, I'm cringing looking at it because I'm like, I know how much pain I'm in, but it actually kind of looks funny as well, <laughs> a little bit. Oh, so you, you know, can laugh at I it. I can laugh. I love okay. laughing at it now because, okay. you know, I passed be, it. So. It was like devastating then, though, wasn't it? I mean, I know, but I mean, in the end, I won. So I was like, right. oh my God, I can't believe I won this. You know, right. I'm like, this is, yeah, I was really proud of myself. I kind of, you know, gave myself a little bit on the show. I was like, you know, this is pretty cool. You think you'd tough it out uh, now if you were in the same s situation, or was it more like then more was on? I'm, I'm a competitor, okay. so yeah. I definitely would, uh, you know, try and grind it out. But, you know, again, I managed to finish it at six and, and won the next game, 6-4. I think if I'd lost that and kind of had to play three more games, it would have looked differently. Yeah. I don't know how I would have survived that.